Friends, um, I'm going to make a really quick freezer treat for you. This is um, a peanut butter whip fat bomb. I love my fat bombs and I love everything peanut butter and chocolate. So this is going to be quick. We're going to do about a oh, cup, cup and a half of whipping cream. And I'm going to mix in, I'm not even really doing like serious measurements here. We're going to mix in about maybe about a teaspoon and a half of sweetener. So I'm going to pop this on really quickly and let's beat this until it's forming some really nice peaks. Should be pretty quick. You know this is a little bit boring, but it's pretty fast. You can see it is starting to form peaks in here already. Once that starts to whip up really well, we're going to put in about two tablespoons of peanut butter. I happen to love the Kroger brand of natural peanut butter. And I'm going to use the natural crunchy because I happen to really love crunchy peanut butter. Okay, so we're starting to get good um, cream out of this. Mmm, tastes great. Just another minute. I'm going to put just a dash, just a little drop of vanilla in here. We're just about done. I don't want to put too much vanilla because then it overpowers it. But that looks just about right. You can see how quickly that went. So now I'm just going to take, this is the Kroger Natural Crunchy Peanut Butter. There is nothing in here but roasted peanuts and salt. And I am just going to fold this in. I'm going to do about two tablespoons. One two. I'm going to just fold this in here, mix it nicely. You want to mix it in well so that it looks like you've got peanut butter in with your whipped cream. I don't know if you can see how this is mixing, but it's starting to mix in and color the whipped cream. Then I'm going to take this just by the spoon and put it into my prepared um, tins. All I did was put a little bit of um, coconut oil in there. I don't know if you can see, I'm just mixing this in. Now, after I put this in the freezer for a few minutes, I'm going to heat up a quarter of a cup of the heavy cream. I'm going to heat it with two squares, which is um, two ounces of 100% unsweetened um, baker's chocolate. To that, I'm going to add just a little bit uh, to taste. I'm going to I'm going to taste it. I'm going to add just a little bit of um, Sweetener, I happen to like a blend of stevia, erythritol, and um, oh, what's the other one? Anyway, it's a blend. It's not a pure stevia, um, but it is a blend. And it's a little bit more gentle where I find the pure stevia to be too sweet. Um, and I, although I love my sweets, I don't like things that are too sweet that just kind of make my tummy churn. So anyway, I'm going to mix that up and then I will drizzle that over the top of these and we are going to have delicious peanut butter chocolate whips from the freezer. So when that's all done, I will take a nice picture and I will post that along with this video for you. But you can see how quickly this came together and it is a fabulous fat bomb treat. Uh, once I get this done, I will put it into my bariatric pal 
or Veritastic, I should say, my Veritastic app, and I will give you the macros on this as well. I hope you guys enjoy it. I'll see you soon. Bye.